What is going on on YouTube and welcome back to the JDW Sports Podcast and today I'm going to talk about whether or not the Colts should re-sign veteran defensive end Justin Houston. Now, don't get me wrong, I really like Houston. I really like his character and, and, and I like some of the things that he brings to the field. But what I don't like is that he's inconsistent, he's aging, and he's only like He's only a passing down guy, you know. He he's a liability in the run game. He's man. Don't get me wrong. Like, like I love the dude. The dude has an amazing character, you know. He always out there pumping up the team for every game. You always see him in the circles. Always pumping up the team, pumping up the defense. Always getting their blood flowing. Always motivating them and getting them going. And and he's a great guy in the locker room. A great veteran presence. Um, so, you know, I don't, I don't think it'd be a bad idea to bring him back. Um, especially since Danico Autry went on with the Titans and re-signed with the Titans. And signed with the Titans, I think, I think we need some veteran at defensive end. Whether it's Houston, whether it's, uh, who else is out there? Melvin Ingram, Sheldon Richardson, Jadavion Clowney, just to name a few, um, I wouldn't mind any of them, but I'd rather bring Houston back or bring Melvin Ingram in. Those are my two choices, but if you want to know my final answer, whether or not we should bring Justin Houston back, I say yes. You know, I, I've been back and forth in this, but <clears throat> if the price is right, yes, because we are desperately, desperately missing a veteran presence on the edge. They're all unknown. We resigned Al Qadi Muhammad. We resigned Kamoko Torre. Or no, Kamoko Torre has been there. Ram Banagu has been there. Taekwon Lewis is defensive tackle. You can play outside as well. He's been on and off. So it's like outside of the defensive tackle position, it's that defensive line is so inconsistent. It's and this defense really needs a solid edge rush to really to really be a deep a good defense, that's what this Tampa 2 relies on, a good a good pass rush, a good edge rush, because if you don't have a good pass, ru- pass rush, and you're running a Tampa 2, you're going to get picked apart by any quarterback. I don't care who it is, they're going to pick you apart. So, yeah, Chris Ballard really needs to make it a priority to really either resign Houston, well, yeah, resign Houston and really draft the guy early at that 21st pick. We need, need to make sure we address that end position. Big time. Big time. Big time. I get we I get we still have to address left tackle, but but I'm okay with going with edge in the first round because the tackle class is deep. And we signed Julian Davenport and Sam Heavy, so they're they're decent guys to back up on. Not Sam Heavy, but I know Julian Davenport is very, very solid backup. So, let me know what you guys think. You guys think the Colts should resign Justin Houston? I think so. Um, especially after using Danico Autry, I think we should resign him to have some kind of veteran presence at defensive end. Um, so, let me know what you guys think, Colts fans, any fans. That's it for this video. Uh, thank you for watching.